Hello everyone, it's all in Austria from Salad Master 316 Health. We are here in Sydney. I'm here to share you our one of our popular dish that we would like uh, that everyone wants to cook for for them every time uh, they see Salad Master. And this is the uh, crackled pork belly. Okay, so I'm gonna show you first uh, what we're going to use today. I'm gonna use the electric skillet, the electric oil uh, core skillet, which will be cooking our. Uh, pork belly. Uh, we only have one ingredient for this dish and that is your pork belly. But to prepare your pork belly so that we can fry it very good, um, we just have to score the skin. Okay, so score the skin. All right, make sure that you have this, uh, you know, um, okay, that's the uh, size of your pork belly. Okay, both sides. And also, uh, I need to put some um, sea salt for this just to remove the moisture out of the skin so that when we cook it, you have that crackling golden brown uh, skin. So we can cook evenly the uh, pork belly. Uh, after you score, and normally you leave it for an hour just to remove the, the remaining moisture from the skin. And so if we cook it, what, I, what technique I normally use is that I cut this into a smaller chunk. Okay, like that square using your very sharp salad master knife. Okay. That's good. So the, the method is very easy. Okay. We will going to preheat the electric oil skillet for 185 degrees. To check if it's already hot, it's very simple guys. Just Sprinkle a little bit of water in there, so that's good enough, that's hot enough to basically fry uh, this uh, uh, pork belly. Okay, now this is a technique. I'm gonna use 15 minutes each of the side of the pork belly and the last part is the skin. Okay, so 15 minutes here, 15 minutes here, 15 minutes here, and then about 10 minutes on the skin. And the temperature is around 185. Both, uh, all the all the sides of your pork belly and after that you will have a very crackling delicious pork belly all right let's start okay okay and then after that, as simple as that, 185 degrees, and then we time it for one side for 15 minutes. As a technique, all right, and you can add this in your, your method of cooking for your pork belly. I'm gonna put the paper towel there, and then crack the lid a little bit, so the moisture that comes from the belly will be trapped into this paper towel, so it will not go to your uh, to your food, and you will have a very crunchy uh, skin later on. Okay, so let's just wait for another 15 minutes. I'll come back to you, and then we'll go and and, and flip it to the other side of the uh, of your pork belly. 15 minutes has gone. We just have to flip to the other side. But before we do that, let me just time it again. So I just don't want to change the temperature. So once uh, I reach one minute. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna adjust it again to another 50 minutes. This time the third side of the third side of your pork belly. Okay. Um, and make sure that it's 185 degrees. Alright. Now look at that beautiful color. Um, so I'm just gonna flip it to the other side. Oh look at that. Okay. Wonderful. Alright. Okay. All right. See that all that oil that uh, sits out from all the uh, fat, so we're getting that out from the meat. And then this time, we'll just cut the lid a little bit again, and for another 15 minutes. See you in the last 15 minutes before we flip to the, the skin. All right. And we're back. So I'm then gonna adjust this again. To 15 minutes before it turn it off. That's just the technique, so you don't change the temperature, the the heat of your of your EOC. And this time we're gonna flip it to the last part, which is 
the, the skin. So this time you have enough oil, okay? Make this, uh, your, your, um, your skin uh, crispy, okay? Another 50 minutes. Again, another paper towel. Make sure that it doesn't have that. All right. And that's the last bit. The next thing you'll see me is that we have that crispy cropping for them. And we're ready on the last part. Okay, this is exciting because we cook this with no oil. All right, normally we cook our pork belly, we boil it first, and then uh, we uh, put a lot of salt in there on it. We, um, we um, fry it for a couple of hours, or oven, put it in the oven a couple hours before we can get that crunchy uh, skin. But here in Salad Master, you don't need to put oil, you don't even to boil uh, the pork belly. And yet you can, you can actually cook it very, very, uh, very easy. And, uh, and you're removing most of the oil coming from the, uh, the fats. All right. Look at that wonderful majestic color. All right. So let me just show you the skin. All right. Look at that skin. So I'm gonna just put it here just to remove the extra the extra oil. Okay. Oh, look at that. My goodness. Who was? Who don't want to eat that one? Yeah. Okay. Again, this is a, a food and cook it once in a while. Okay. This is, an, this is not an everyday, everyday or daily food. Okay, just once in a while, just to indulge yourself. Okay, there you go. Now, we didn't cook this with oil. We basically used the skillet and cooked that uh, uh, pork belly with no oil, and then you produce that golden brown, crispy um, skin. I'm going to show you something really, really, um, uh, what do you call this? Uh, you're not aware but you're doing it. Now, normally, as I say, we use a lot of oil or we deep fry uh, our pork belly because we believe, that's what we believe, that when we fry, we need oil. Here is a proof that uh, you don't need oil. So really, if you if you fry in your meat or your, any food, you, you basically using a lot of oil, but in salad so you remove that completely. And look at what I produce, or that pork belly produced out of the cookware, or out of this frying. Look at all that fats and oils coming from the pork belly. And yet, we didn't use a single drop of oil. Okay, now let me show you, okay, how crackling this is. I'm just gonna get one of this here. Okay, are you ready for this? Okay, one, come closer camera. Let them hear this. Okay. All right, that's a very crunchy, look at that. It's really good. Let me just go on here, another one. Okay, another one here. Ooh, delicious. <laughs> okay. Look at that, wonderful.